It's the tapping just that is it? That is pure happiness, isn't it? <laughs> it's pure happiness. Well she's gonna have a sister soon, eh, cummies? I'm back and I'm active and I'm ready. Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I know it's been a couple of weeks since I haven't posted on YouTube much, um, but for this video, I'm going to be giving you some form of updates on what's been going on in the past few weeks and what's going to be happening in the next few weeks. So I hope you enjoy, if you do, please splash a huge thumbs up and if you'll see my face for the first time, press that subscribe button. Without further ado, let's get started. So this time last week, I became really ill. I had food poisoning, which lasted for about four or five days. Um, I was over my partners and I became really lethargic and kept bringing up bile it was so horrible um, my partner became worried he started getting emotional as he's never seen me like this before he called the ambulance out and my temperature was high but the rest of it was absolutely normal um, but yeah I, I, I had a few poisoning fortunately though I have fully recovered so yeah that's why I haven't uploaded within the past week or so and I do apologise because I haven't had the energy or anything like that to vlog or edit because food poison takes out a lot of energy. Here comes the exciting bit. So in the next week or so, I have thought long and hard about this decision. Um, so has you all aware that we recently adopted a dog called Karma. Um, she isn't actually my dog, she isn't my brother's, she isn't my mother's, she is my father's. Um, but we kind of like had a family discussion on whether to adopt another dog after losing two Jack Russells. We don't know, we didn't know whether it was the right time to adopt it at that time, um, but I'm kind of glad we did because it kind, of, it kind of took away the pain that we have a dog in a house and Jesse and Elsa would always be in our hearts and it was so painful um, for us as a family to realise that the two dogs we had are gone. Um, so yeah, we made the decision whether to adopt Carmen or not, has a family, even though it's my dad's dog because he paid for Carmen and blah, blah. Carmen has now settled in, as you can tell from my dad's YouTube channel. Um, but I keep thinking, I've been thinking so long and hard, I really want my own dog. So, I've gone and looked up a um, dog that I might be adopting. So last week I went to visit a dog named Zeta. She is a 10 month old Gallego, um, which is a Spanish greyhound, believably 10 month, we don't know exact age of the dog itself um but she to me she looked like a young dog she was between like one maybe two years old um but she does need to be fed quite a lot she's quite skinny and everything like that uh, she is believed to be terrified of males but when i went to visit her on sunday the sunday that just went i rang up my dad and he said he'll bring carmen over so he he then brought Carmen over straight after I went to visit Zeta, so we both saw her together. And 
yeah, Zita and Carmen got on so well. And yeah, she wasn't frightened of my dad whatsoever. So I thought, you know, I'm going to give her a trial and see how it goes. Um, but I, I guarantee she would absolutely love Carmen. So I filled out the form today because I reached out to SN Dogs on the night of the Sunday I got home I emailed Essen Dog saying that like you know I really want to give her a trial and see how she gets along with Carmen and they replied back and they asked me to fill in a bunch of forms which I did today so I did that and I'm waiting to hear back so hopefully fingers crossed when I get back from Dorset which is next sorry I'm leaving to Dorset for four nights as it's my 28th birthday next Thursday, a week today. Oh my god, I'm turning 20, I can't believe it. Um, so yeah, first holiday going away with my boyfriend and I will be trying to vlog majority of our holiday behind our holiday together because like since we've been together and <laughs> lockdown started and we couldn't get away anywhere. So I've been itching to have our own little get away together just me and my boyfriend but I'll, I'll be vlogging bits and pieces so you guys can see what's going on um but yeah that is the exciting news and as for my bedroom guys um there's not much change since my last youtube video all that change is my dad's put up some shelves behind me as you can see and it just kind of looks nice with the led lights and yeah it looks a bit more homely now the wall hasn't finished as you can see over there it's still a bit paperless um but yeah there'll be more bedroom redecorating in the future months i would say so episode two will be coming very very soon so watch out for that i hope you guys enjoy and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video bye i hope you're excited as i am